Hi, I'm Thura Zakahi, and I am going to demonstrate the two basic methods on how to wrap the surgical instruments, gown, and drape packs. But before we proceed, we must inspect and make sure that these materials are properly folded and have no flaws. The instruments are separated and placed in order of their intended use. Here, the drapes are placed at the bottom, the surgical tray with the instruments in the middle, and the surgical gown at the top. Now we're good to go. The first method is called the square method. As you can see here, the materials are placed on the wrappers. The edges of these materials are parallel to the edges of the wrapper. The first step is to fold the left side into an accordion pleated manner. Here, we have a flap that is useful during pack opening. We will do the same fold on the right side. Now, the perpendicular sides will be folded across the left and right pleated folds. Now we have a complete inner wrap. The outer wrap will be folded in the same manner as the inner wrap. Most hospitals double wrap packs when using cloth to reduce contamination of surgical accoutrements. Lastly, this will be secured using an autoclave tape. Now, our pack is done and ready for autoclave. Since we are using cloth, the only compatible sterilization method is steam autoclave. The second method is called the angled method. Here, as you can see, the materials are still placed on the two wrappers. However, the edges of these materials are in line with the corners of the wrappers. So the first edge of the wrapper is folded like this so that the pleats will create uh, triangular tabs which are useful during pack opening. So this second edge will be folded across the triangular tab creating another triangular tab as well as the other side will be folded in the same manner. This last edge will cover the previous sides and is tucked under the previous folds. This will create a triangular tab also, which is useful for 
pack opening. Now the outer wrap is folded in the same manner as the inner wrap. Lastly, we're going to secure our pack with an autoclave tape. Now, our pack is done and is ready for autoclave. The principle behind the wrapping is to wrap the instrument packs in a sense that they can be easily unwrapped without breaking the sterile technique. 